Meanwhile, in Beaverton, the school district tells us that students at nearly all their high schools, as well as some middle and elementary schools, participated in the national walkout as well. Eileen Park is at Sunset High School with how their walkout went. Eileen? Jenny, today's walkout was well thought out by student leaders. It was organized, it was peaceful, and many had pre-made signs that expressed how they feel about gun violence. Hundreds at Sunset High left their classrooms today to stand in solidarity with students all over the country to remember the 17 people who died in Parkland. I talked with a lot of students, and many told me that they don't want to live in fear anymore. They say they're afraid because of the regularity of school shootings in the country. They're also concerned with the way Congress is weary about tackling gun legislation, especially concerning semi-automatic weapons, which are often used in mass shootings. This is our lives at stake. Truly, like, our country was founded by people who believed in something and they stood up for what they believed in, and that's what we're doing today. And what do you believe in? I believe that we have a right to go to school without fear, without wondering if we'll come home without having to tell our parents we love them every day with the fear that we won't come home to tell them that same thing. Students tell me this is just the beginning. They're drafting letters to their state legislators and are planning a march very soon. They also say they feel empowered by the Parkland students who have been effective in mobilizing to use their voices powerfully to affect change. And they hope that their voices will also be heard too here at Sunset High. Back to you. Yeah, and you can really feel it, Eileen, when these students talk. They do feel that sense of empowerment. Thank you very much. Well,